When the Oklahoma Sooners came to Waco last season, they gave the Bears gave them quite a game. Oklahoma only won by eight. Now this year's Baylor squad is much improved from that 2017 team. They were hoping to pull the upset in Norman today. Bears visiting the sixth ranked Sooners. Kyler Murray sat out the first series because he was late to a meeting, but it didn't really matter. Sooners already have seven nothing. Murray hits Grant Calcaterra, who makes the great catch for the touchdown. 14 nothing. OU. Baylor got on the board late in the first quarter. Charlie Brewer is going to find Denzel Mims. PAT no good. 14 6 Sooners. Second half now. Sooners up 35 23. Hollywood Brown is going to go ahead and take it 50 yards for his second touchdown of the game, making it look easy. Extending Oklahoma's lead 42 23. Murray threw six touchdowns today. He also rushed for one. Baylor trying to stay alive. Brewer finds Jalen Hurd for her second touchdown of the night, but it wouldn't be enough. The Sooners win. And they win big 66 to 33. Sports director Nick Canazales is in Norman and he brings us more from tonight's game. Nick. Well, Jess, Matt Rule has preached all season long about not giving up explosive plays. The defense gave up six touchdowns of 30 yards or more. And of course, Oklahoma's offense, they rolled up over 600 total yards. Bears could not stop Kyler Murray, who threw for 432 yards and accounted for seven touchdowns. After the game, Matt Rule spoke about the explosive plays they're going to have to work on next week and the rest of the season. We, we have to eliminate that. We're not going to we're not going to be a great team until we, you know, eliminate the big plays. And some of those at the end, I mean, we're bound they're, you know, we're tackling them in the backfield and the guys bouncing off and running for a touchdown. So, you know, that's why I said to our team, "Hey, we all got to look at ourselves, you know, and um, you know, it's easy to say this that this. No, let's look at ourselves and um, um, see what we can do better. Uh, frustrating, but that's kind of been our emphasis all year is uh, stop explosive plays and we didn't really feel like they can nickel and dime us down the field or, you know, Temple uh, you know, work us down the field. Um, they were kind of scoring off of those explosive plays. So, you know, I feel like if we would eliminated those, we'd have been in better shape. So, the Bears are hoping to bounce back next week when they host Kansas State at 2:30 at McLean Stadium in Norman, Oklahoma. Nick Canazales, Channel Six Sports. Thanks, Nick.